So far, during the uh, water recovery operations, we've located nine uh, vehicles submerged. Uh, for eight of those nine vehicles, we have accounted for the people whom were inside. For one of the vehicles, we have not. Um, uh, the rest of this afternoon and this evening during dive operations, we'll continue to focus on the upstream part of the river, uh, continuing to clear that area. And when I say clear, I mean check for uh, objects, vehicles using uh, divers. I want to say that, uh, you know, we've talked about this a number of times before, the treacherous conditions on the river bottom in terms of uh, visibility, you know, anywhere from six feet, six inches to two feet uh, being described as kind of a, a fog, uh, really the braille method, just having to reach out and touch things. That continues to uh, be the case. In fact, this morning, uh, one of our divers, the one you met the other day, Eric Herman, did get caught up for a while on uh, one of the vehicles that we've now removed from the river. Uh, some tense uh, moments there. We did uh, get them out A-OK, -okay, but again, that's what these divers are facing each time they go into that water for their shifts.